Good evening, Lizzie boys. I don't know what I'm doing today, but we're doing a Lizzie's board vlog because I'm bored. I'm really bored. Do you like Phoebe's bangs? I tried to get them to, like, not be separated. So yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I guess the first thing I want to do is show you all my brand new sweetheart Lily. Not that she's brand new, I definitely didn't unbox her, but she came all the way from Denmark. And uh, good for her. I'm glad she made it safely. Her hair is very nice. She's got her, the main part of her first outfit and her second pair of shoes, plus a Bratz Babies Phoebe purse, which is actually super cute. I like it. I gave her this clip from my Funk and Glow Yasmin, who is still nude. I still need her clothes. And she just kind of had these sunglasses, but they look cute on her, so I left them alone. I am looking for her jewelry still. I don't have it, but it looks just like Phoebe's, but in pink. So if any of you have that, let me know. But yeah, this Lily is totally gorgeous. I'm obsessed with her. I love her so much. And her hair is so soft, but it's also kind of puffy, so I might boil wash it. But I also don't want to straighten it because I do like the slight bit of curl wave wave that's going on and i don't have any straws to curl doll hair with so uh so today's a fun day um i'm thinking i'll talk about this while i try to sort out my doll room a little so i can make this another bit of a cleaning video just for the satisfaction of you all who still remind me every day that my room is messy trust me i know i walk in here every day and i see the mess but um made a purchase that I'm very happy with today. Um, I guess I'll just push this into the corner for now. Shit. So one of you was selling their childhood Bratz dolls, and one of those dolls was a Sweet Dreams Felicia, among others. I'm keeping the others as a surprise, so I'll have something fun. Oh yeah, I bought this from my friend Dolls in My Heart. Love her. So, um, old Kaya pants but anyway he was selling some of his childhood dolls and I then I found out that he was actually a viewer of my channel which made me even more excited to buy because it'll kind of be like opening a fan mail package even though I paid for it you know it's like kind of like vaguely whatever so this is a plastic tie I need to vacuum so as I was saying before I keep losing my train of thought you know what? I'm just going to say it real quick. I got a Sweet Dreams Felicia. Finally. Among her are some other dolls because he had them packaged in like bags of three to four. So I'm getting seven dolls total. And the grand total of everything was under $300, which is so good. This guy is really nice. I'm going to link his social media so you guys can see if he has any dolls that you might be interested in because he is selling some more, I believe. He had a bunch of bags. I don't know how many sold specifically, but I'm just very grateful that I got to Felicia first. God, I have been wanting Sweet Dreams Felicia all year. So I'm very excited to get that package. It's coming all the way from over on in Europe. <laughs> it's so far. It's like Sweden. That's like so far, I think. Right? Yeah, it's pretty far. But I'm very excited for it. It's going to be great. It'll be a very fun unboxing video. Oh yeah, these are all the dolls I have for sale, by the way. I still don't know what I'm doing with this dress. Do any of you need it? I'll sell it for like 5 or $6, I guess. I don't know. I don't have an extra blondie for it. I still haven't made this haul video. A story balding. I'm going to sell her, too. These dolls have been standing with this display for like several years. I don't know why. I really don't. Um, I probably don't need all these little party things. I don't think anyone cares about them. I definitely don't need this. It came with Secret Date Chloe's top, which is also a Dana top. So yeah, I don't think I need that. I don't know what to do with this scarf thing. This is a random rubber band. I'm just trying to sort everything out because I've got a lot of trash in here. This is going to the trash bag, which is closed. We got to start a new trash bag. Luckily, I have 
a lot of bags for the sole purpose of eventually using his trash bags. Can you see why I have a problem? Little random fact about me is whenever I buy something and they send me a letter with it, I always try to keep the letter just because they usually say something so sweet. So I think temporarily, why do I have a plastic bag up here? Oh, what the hell is this? Trash now. I'll just leave them here for now. So cleaning this room is so overwhelming. Let's go into the closet of doom, which is even more overwhelming. <sighs> Did I ever show you guys my, the my bling bling Chelsea? Yeah, one of you actually sent her to me, along with one of those notes that thanked them for inspiring them to start collecting. It was super sweet. This is honestly the greatest gift I've ever like accepted i always feel so guilty accepting gifts because like i always at least want to pay shipping so if you ever want to like send me something at least let me cover shipping please i just feel so guilty if i don't pay anything especially when it's an inbox mycene doll like that that's just crazy but it's still like a very sweet gift okay got a little walkway i can go in the shape of an l like L from the hit anime Death Note, which I've been watching recently. Allow me to elaborate on that. Misa is my wife. She's actually a lesbian and is married to me. Just, just a little fun fact. I thought you deserved to know. Before someone gets all mad in the comments, ooh. Actually, get mad in the comments. I like blocking homophobes. <laughs> um, I don't know who any of this goes to. This looks like Brat's boys' pants, so I'll just give that to him. And I don't know whose these are. I also don't know who this jacket belongs to. If any of you know what these pieces are from, please tell me because I have no clue right now. For now, they're just going to sit with the Bratz boy to cover him. Oh, wait. Yeah, I forgot I have an extra Cleo lie. Hmm. I can't find my Cleo lie. Oh, I see her. Yeah, my personal one looks better. I like that I can see her eyebrows. This one's all right. I think I'll just resell her. Um, sorry, I'm just trying to sort myself. Yeah, so I'll be reselling this one. I'll most likely take her earrings, though, because mine is missing her earrings for some reason, so. Probably be like 15 bucks. I don't know. What's a fair price for Cleo Lai? Does anybody care about her? You know what? For a fusion, Cleo Lai is not that bad. I always liked her growing up. I think Jackie Becca was my favorite, though, but I think it's mostly because they managed to make her so cute. But anyway, to the cell pile you go. She has original rubber bands. Good for her. I have to sell a lot of things because $280 for that package I mentioned? It's a good deal. But it's still not cheap, so... <laughs> sell to cover. Sometimes I forget that I have rainbow idols over here. Like, I know where my jades are at. I just, like, forget, though. You know? You know what? Actually, I'm I'm wondering something. Can... No. God damn it. Well, maybe... This might be revolutionary. The moment I clicked record, Sunny fell and Jade just ate shit. Sunny was positioned just like this. There was no reason for her to fall. But yeah, this will work for now. They are making intense eye contact and everybody's just waiting for who's gonna throw the first punch, I guess. I feel like all I've done in this video is talk and clean up things that I cleaned up in the last one, but I messed up again between them. Which is probably exactly what I've done. I don't know what to do with Kaya's extra hand and pants. I don't know. Uh, this is a plastic bag. I got this for free at Walmart. Just kidding, I paid for it. Huh. That's not as bad as I expected it to get. Did I ever show you guys my genie magic Chloe? I redid her hair myself. It's so good until you see this bump in her ponytail over here. So I'll just keep her on this side.
Wow, I'm slacking off again. I got these extra OMG leggings. I don't remember where. I still have an unboxed Bebe Bonita. God damn it. Where'd she go? There she is. Why do I still have this? And these are a bunch of Rainbow High. Where did I get so many extras? Did I just never open them? I still have a Target receipt. I don't remember why I kept this tag. I don't think this is Roxy. No, wait, it is Roxy. That's why I kept it. Roxy. Rare Roxy art. Good for me. Nothing changed. I am very sad now. Thank you for watching this vlog where I attempt to clean and fail. The best cleaning will be when I find a place to put all of these. I always manage to amass a bunch of dolls on the floor, huh? Well, it's mostly because my shelves are pretty full. If you're wondering where Sierna is, she's in my room. But anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And as always, I hope to see you in my next one. And yeah, bye bye